A warm welcome to Anuradha Vedic Astrology. Today we are going to talk about the topic all of us want to know about. What is that? Am I lucky? Well, with Goel sir, this is what we are going to know from him. Because this is one of the topics that he has written in his new book, Are You Lucky? But before that, a big thanks to all of you for liking, sharing and subscribing to our YouTube and Spotify channels and writing in your and your questions, your and writing in your suggestions and your opinions there. If you haven't subscribed to us, please do. And do remember to press the bell icon so that you can get the updates. Yes, if pronounce it. No, it's not. So Sir, are we lucky? I am lucky. <laughs> okay, sir. And Whether how do you know that? Whether I the combination I am going to tell is present or not, but I am lucky. Okay, sir. Okay. So okay. don't feel that you are not lucky. Right, sir. First of all, but you must understand what is luck. Hmm. Who is called lucky? Hmm. Parasharji, while describing D4, has said, from this chart, we see Bhagya Chinta. Hmm. That consideration of your luck. Bhagya. Bhagya is not having any straight word in English language. In Hindi, Bhagya has a very vast meaning. Hmm. So, what in English, what we can describe as Bhagya is Getting a divine help when you expected it least. When there was no expectation and you get it. That you are going on a road and your car hits a tree and no traffic, nobody is there. It is night time or something. Hmm. And even then you get a help. Hmm. That is called a divine. Because it is also predetermined that you will meet an accident and somebody will be there to rescue you. Okay. So that is the real meaning of uh, are you lucky? Many people win lotteries, etc. Unexpected things happen. That also can be counted as a luck. And that is also because of divine help. So, whenever there is a divine help and you do not expect a thing to happen and it happens. Now we come to the astrology. In astrology, first of all, let me tell you Gajkesari. That is described as a strong you. That the person having Gajkesari you will kill his enemies or will be always successful like a lion kills an elephant. And one third of the population has is having <laughs> Yes. So one third of the population will be like lion. But it is not so. I have a Gajkes Vio, but I am Darpok. <laughs> okay. So the test of Gajkes Vio is in D4. Hmm. I think Parashaji has silently mentioned it. Why and how? See, in the Kalpuru horoscope, fourth house is the house of happiness 
and ninth house is the house of luck. Bhagya. Yes. And Bhagya Chinta is D4. Right, sir. So if in D4, Jupiter and Moon, natural planets causing Gajkesri are not related in D4, then that Gajkesri is not fruitful. Yes. No fear from here. You must have understood who is lucky. Mm. Moon and Jupiter, usual connection in D4. Karl Purush, Lagna Lord, Mars, with Bhagya, Ninth Lord, Jupiter. Mm. Mars and Jupiter in mutual relation in D4. Now we come to the horoscope. Lagna Lord and Ninth Lord of the horoscope. Fourth Lord and Ninth Lord of the horoscope. That their mutual connection in D4. And the Lord also we are seeing in D4. That gives you, that makes you lucky. That the God will shower blessings bless for you in time of need. Another type of blessing is moon and Venus connection or mutual relation. That is considered a big radio in Gemini also and in Parashari. So in D4 when they are connected mutually it gives a sense of happiness because moon is the lord of fourth house of natural zodiac and Venus is the karak of fourth house of happiness. So karak and lord they can be together mutual aspect anywhere in horoscope that gives a sense of satisfaction and happiness from your work. So these are the rules. Yes. In short, I have summed up everything. Yes. yes. Sir, can we take the chart of Indira Gandhi and then one more chart? Yeah, of any, any chart. This is Indira Gandhi. Okay. Now you see Moon and Jupiter, <clears throat> they are not connected. Only Mars and Jupiter are in mutual aspect. But so this is the Lagna and, and the, the ninth house. Yes, Lord. Yes. Fourth house is not involved here. No, no. So you are lucky, but you are not getting happiness from it. Yes. And secondly, Mercury has joined Mars. Yes. That is the bad factor. Mercury is the third and sixth lord that has spoiled the luck. Mm. Otherwise, she will not be assassinated. Some mm. help will come. She would have survived. So that is the reason. Uh, it is not a 100% perfect uh, uh, that, um, lucky yoga. Lucky the... yoga. Yes. Yes. And then okay. said, yeah, Rahman, this is another chart. Yeah. Okay. In this chart also, Jupiter and Moon are not connected. Not related. Okay. Tarak and but Moon, but moon and, and Venus. And Venus. Venus. Hmm. Moon and Venus. They are in mutual art. Hmm. So he is satisfied, he is feeling lucky and he is happy. Because of his work. Why we call him A.R. Rahman? You should call him Dalip Kumar. Yes. His birth name is Dalip Kumar. Yes. Sir. This is uh, very beautiful. 
we generally at times says this is my luck it's not good but do check in your d4 see if there is a connection of the lagna lord and the ninth lord see if mars and jupiter are connected or for that matter mars uh, jupiter and moon a connection of venus and moon can also give you a satisfaction a sense of achievement whatever that you have done obviously deshkal patra matters write in your views see how it works in your chart and we will also reply to your queries till we meet with you again stay safe thank you so much sir thank for you. this wonderful class thank you very much please hit the bell icon for fresh updates don't forget to like share and comment on the videos and please subscribe to our channel